Before you use the macro, you need to do three things. The first thing is to set your resolution to 1920x1080 and have scale on 100%. The next thing you would have to do is to make this exact same build. The build will be in the description and you will need to get shot bow with the triple shot variant. Make sure you have the hot bar set the same as mine. For the gems and mantra modifiers, I have a wind gem on tornado, blast gem on astral wind, blue gem on reinforce, wind gem on blinding dawn, blue gem on gale wisp, insignia gem on gale punch, and blue gem on wind passage. The last thing you have to do is to have your sensitivity set to 0.3. Not your window sensitivity, but your Roblox sensitivity. So to download the script, you have to go to the stuffs channel of my Discord, and here's the Fairman file. It's called Fairman zip file. Just download this, click continue to download, and you would have a zip file downloaded. So once you have the zip file downloaded, put it to a folder where you would want to save it, double click it, there would be a file in it, like so. Drag it back out to the folder, as shown, and you're done. So inside this file, there will be a Fairman folder and a Deepoken Fairman macro. So to use the macro, you will need to have auto hotkey installed. If you do not have auto hotkey installed, check the description, there will be a video on how to install it. And for the Fairman folder, it's just a bunch of images for the image recognition. You can leave it as is. Make sure you have the Deepoken macro and the Fairman images folder in the same folder. So, to run the program, just double click on the Deep Woken Ferryman macro and it will say reloaded, as shown here. So, once you're in game, before you join Ferryman, press the button P on your keyboard and it will say waiting for campfires. This means that you have to load into the instance yourself. So, you have to do this manually. So, just place down the four campfires and light them up. So, once you light up the campfires, just stand still. The macro will, will run the dungeon for you, loot the chest and leave. But if there are any errors, you should edit the macro accordingly because I made this for myself and I have no idea how to make it for different settings. So once it loads in again, it's gonna select the campfire and it's gonna shift load for you. So all you have to do is put back down the campfires, light them up again and don't do anything. You can kick out the campfires if you want to, but you don't need to do that. Then just don't touch your keyboard. It will loop infinitely until you press the interrupt key. Okay, so the macro is not perfect and sometimes it uh, fucks up. Like shown in the video. So to cancel the macro when it fucks up, all you have to do is press M on your keyboard. After you press M on your keyboard, it will say reloaded and you, you will have to kill Fairman yourself manually. But with the build, all you have to do is stay far away from him. And just, you know, shoot him with one trust. That's about it. Don't have to do anything else. If the script doesn't work, don't ask me, because I don't know how to fix it for you.